Hi to everybody. Uh, yesterday I make a video and it looks like I found something how to recover gold. So today I decided to go to my places where is quartz, but I never see visible gold. So I want to get some quartz and try to recover gold at least a little bit to see can I get the gold in this place and you see here you see how many rocks is smooth because this is all time as was digging for gold and not even all timers now people doing the same thing look this is fresh made holes and this one here Imagine the move those rocks to get some little pieces of gold. Ooh. So I'm going to my place right now and get some samples. I want to get another idea and I want to test it. So if everything works, you will see it. And right now, I just go get some quartz where I thinking is invisible gold no not invisible but there is gold okay oh my gosh imagine how much work people do for the gold <clears throat> how much energy I don't know I just like to found place and found recover the gold that is my my idea to get it that gold but work for gold i'm not interested you younger you can do it <laughs> i'm getting enough money to live and buy whatever i want and i don't need that gold yeah somebody need gold because look how many rocks they move it my god how much they dirt dig it all this dig by the hands all those rocks they put it on the side taking the gold from underneath those rocks okay so let's go to my place and we'll see what we can get okay yeah, look what kind of views I have. This is Cairn River. Okay. Big boulders, rocks, 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 rocks. And I try to go to my place where I found some interesting rock. And I went get it, that rock. Okay. Wow, and this is all the old time lava rocks. <sighs> yeah. Really. So on the way to my place, I found another spot where quartz coming out on surface. You see this? So I'll be taking some samples. And this definitely have a gold over here. This one is like having a lot of spot is broken where the fluids go so I need to cut little piece of this rock and maybe this one here this looks nice okay all those brown spots potential can they is a gold so let's break it some of them and see what we get it at home so I got some rocks, looks like this, some kind of reddish color, I don't think so, there is visible gold, but I guarantee this is invisible gold, all that dark brown color can be potential gold, so here some kind of sulfides okay and from surface was looking like this when i broke i got this kind of thing 
okay it's the same thing layers you see one two three many layers that is a where the gold travels and between the quartz because this is not one event and if you want to see the visible gold i don't think so you see this gold because maybe those rocks was not heated enough to convert uh, gold chloride to gold you need to have 300 degrees this rock maybe don't got that temperature so we got the precipitated gold is that gold is a it's like a dark brown or something i don't know if this is gold or not but we do the test and we'll see i don't take a lot i just take a few of those rocks that is enough for me because i need to work this is another sample but i don't see dark brown too much but there is some so we do the test and we will see okay and i go to my place to see what i can get okay got some rocks and this is quartz vein going down in the earth so there can be who knows how long and this way and this way this is maybe the same way and way going because it's going the same direction and over there so i go in my place i show you oh yeah it's the same way you just continue over here you see way coming to collect the gold okay it's nice view can sit here enjoy the views so I'll be taking few rocks, not a lot, just few, to see what I can get. Okay. The main thing here is a lot of quartz, but very little visible gold. How quartz looks, I show you in a second. This is a, our quartz. I try to break it, how this quartz is done. You see, this is almost empty. If I crush it, I don't think so I can get something. Maybe on the surface something. So, let's see here. I crushed those little pieces. So let me take just those ones, which one contains something. Okay. This is empty. Actually, this is empty. So, but uh, anytime I grab a sample of dirt over there down, I found the gold. Few specks of visible, but mostly invisible. Today I got some Two, three spoons of that sand too over there for this area because all water raining takes those specks over there and that invisible gold is in that sand too so good place to grab some samples and uh, here taking few specks those little rocks I try to get the dirty ones the dirty ones contains the gold okay wow this is nice sample let's see okay all those dirty looking it's a good ones okay where is the gold maybe no visible and this is one empty you see no no flutes so 
we need to flutes and those flutes can be some kind of gold okay okay i think it's enough one more maybe let me look in dirtiest one this maybe yeah but here like i say no visible gold it's mostly invisible so you need to use chemicals to recover that gold and i show you how to do it you just need to repeat it in your area rocks may be different little bit but if you found some quartz you can get a gold too because gold and quartz going the same way and just how say it they are separate but they going the same way this is how dirty quartz is looking but this dirt can be very expensive okay it's a brown dark brown and this is, can be what we're looking for okay all this what we're looking for no looking in this one but we're looking this one dark one Those black spots can be gold too. I don't know. Yeah, I can work on kilos, but I need to carry that rocks to my house. And that is too much for me. Too much work. I just want to show you how to do it. Uh, you younger people go and do it uh, for me is enough what I getting okay take all those dirty ones okay okay let's see what is in this one what right here it looks like dirt but let's open oh you see that's black spots they're gold is sitting in those ones dots microscopic pieces okay no i think enough for me i can carry a lot so this much i can taking out I was thinking about getting some sand but maybe I just shovel it with this one dirt and do ex another experiment uh -uh, that be enough or maybe I crush a little bit more than you know always maybe 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 who knows what I need to do I need more sand so i crushing right now this rock and uh, we'll see what we get it over there taking some samples and now i'm in the bottom where i'll be taking some sand from here and you see the quartz over here i need to break some of those quartz because this is the layers which one supposed to have a gold those one tiny ones okay not these big ones big ones almost nothing you see it's a clean not even here maybe a lot rust going but over here maybe with that one something having so if you want make a money on the gold you need to have good equipment i not have so i just playing and showing you guys 
how to work with those rocks if you young enough strong enough have the equipment you can use information for your work okay this is a big crystals of quartz you see the crystals how big ones okay but gold is in that one corn over here okay i'm taking some sample sand over here this is you see it's going from the top everything when rain comes it's washing everything gold supposed to be in this this hole over here so i i grab like two three spoons and at home i will test it what he have i recognize that the gold not here because it's clean and not see yellow no lines no nothing and if i break it i don't think so it's something i can found see it's very strong too because everything crystallized yeah it's just no worth playing with that but if you have good equipment i take everything uh, but i don't have and i'm too old to have it that thing I will break it, everything with a, with a spoon. I take it, but I can't tell you that they're nothing. Maybe a little bit. Oh, here. Yeah, you always take dirty ones. Over here looks like something shiny. I have a pirate, a little gold. Okay, I'm done with that area. You see? This is what we're looking for. But this is almost nothing inside, so I don't even take it. Maybe those two take it because of this rock with the gold, I think. Oh, yeah, something shiny. I don't know what is that. Maybe pirate, maybe gold, who knows. Need to look in microscope. Exactly, I forget that microscope. So I'm taking right now dirt and I go home. Okay. Okay. I got some sand from this place. Why I take in this place? Because all water when it rains is sending all material over this way. And what here supposed to be mostly invisible gold or visible, I don't know. I take some like five spoons and we'll see what we get. Okay. I'm done with this area. I leave this quartz for somebody else and I got some samples and I be sitting here resting for enjoying this view. I like this what can river water and I, of course right now it's called winter. If we can say winter when it's 70 degrees outside and I'll be going home. Thanks for watching.